So this is blank. I definitely put a message on here. Where's my message? Louis Vuitton. Welcome back or welcome to my YouTube channel. Just the FYI disclaimer, my dogs are in the background. So you'll probably see them moving around, throwing off my video a little bit, but ignore them because that's either here nor there. But that's the life of a dog mom. So anyways, today I'm going to be doing an unboxing. I got some new shoes. Let you guys know my first impression, what I think. Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, of course, share the video, drop comments in the comment section. Let me know your thoughts. Um, if you have these, let me know what you think about them. Um, but I'm going to give you my honest opinion or whatnot because I've been wanting these shoes for a really long time. So hopefully they live up to the hype in my mind. Let's go ahead and get started. So this is blank. I definitely put a message on here. Where's my message? Louis Vuitton. Where? Where's my message? for this little piece at the back because if you have nails like these like these claws thingies you'll definitely be breaking one if you didn't have that little grip thingy right there and they actually these fit the first time I tried to buy a pair of these I bought them in the wrong size or whatever I bought the Tan ones, I'll insert a picture right here so you guys can see. Um, I bought those and they were too big or whatnot. So I think the first time I had ordered like a 35 and a half, but this time I ordered a 34 and a half, which is pretty much equivalent to like a four and a half. I'm really, so in kids, I'm a four and in women, I am a five and a half, but apparently these run kind of big. I mean, these feel like, I don't know, let me stand up in them. I don't know, I see people lace them all kinds of ways. Okay, so first impression, they're just as beautiful as I thought they were going to be. I love them. They do have some other ones that have like the bigger Louis Vuitton LV on them, like right here, that I like a little bit more, but oh, I've been wanting these for so long, guys. And finally, I just decided to cash out and say, let's just get them, might as well splurge. 2020 has been a tough, but y'all don't even know the half, it's been a tough rough year for me so love them oh they're just so pretty look at the lv in there oh i love this detail i need to get a bag that matches like this print i don't have a bag oh look at this look at the back but look at this tongue too oh it's so gorge I love this. So I don't have a bag that matches these, unfortunately, because for some reason I keep getting shoes before I buy a bag. Is that backwards? Oh, well. Um, but yeah, so I do have a Louis Vuitton clutch that my uh, bae bought me, but it is the black. Yeah, all black uh, look. So it doesn't exactly match this like spot on, but it'll do, right? LV is LV, so... It is what it is, but I mean, 
I'm gonna. I will say the one thing about Louis Vuitton is they are super pricey. Like I have some other Louis Vuitton sneakers, and I feel like the shoes were super pricey, and I don't know why. I mean, I get, that's the thing with labels. Like people just have stuff and they slap their name on it, and it just be like anything else, and it sells because dumbass people like me buy it. Um, but the quality doesn't seem like it's just way better than any other shoe that I've ever purchased. Just my personal opinion on that. We're not speaking specifically to these, but to my other Louis Vuitton shoes, um, I will say they are very uncomfortable. Like, I don't know if anybody has any of the Balenciaga sneaker socks or socks sneakers. Yeah, sock sneakers. But that's essentially what my Louis Vuitton ones are. And they're like, initially when you put them on, they're comfortable, but when you like walking them for a while, they're definitely not the most comfortable shoe to just, yeah, they're just not. So, but these I'm hoping, I mean, they're a little platformers. I mean, on the inside, they're feeling a little hard. I don't know if this is the type of shoe. I might be able to put like an insole or in something in here. Um, but I haven't worn them yet. Obviously, you guys just saw me unbox them. Um, what do y'all think about these? Give me your thoughts. Honest opinion, was it worth it? Should I have left them at the store? I like them. These are gonna, gonna be my combat boot go-tos. Like, yeah, I like them. I don't know. Y'all tell me what you think. Let me know. Again, drop them comments in the comment section. What you think, mamas? You, you like these? She ain't say nothing, obviously. All right, y'all. That was the quick unboxing of these Louis Vuitton. What, what's the name of these shoes? I'm buying stuff. I don't even know the name of them, huh? The Laureate. The Laureate platform boot. Hopefully, I'm saying that right. If I'm not, oh, well. <laughs> I paid uh, the same amount as everybody else, and I'm still going to rock them. You know, people buy sh that they can't pronounce all the time. So, anywho, that's it. Let me know what you think. Like I said, should have kept them at the store. What's your favorite Louis Vuitton shoe if you have one? What do you like about Louis Vuitton? What's your favorite bag? Do you own a bag? Do you want a bag? Like, is am I crazy for paying the amount that I paid for them? We're not going to talk about the price, but... Just let me know what y'all think, okay? Again, overall, I like them. Until next time.